We teach courses that regularly enroll over 100 students. We contribute courses to environmental studies, gender, sexuality, and women's studies, history, the Honors College, Jewish studies, political science, and speech and debate. Since 2017, the number of undergraduate majors the department serves has increased by 31%. We achieved this despite having lost three faculty. Our inability to cover required courses was cited as justification for our termination, even as we continue to offer all necessary courses. Right now, there are 60, yes, 60 students on campus pursuing a course of study in either classics, Latin, or Greek, 11 of whom are double majoring or minoring. UVM is one of the nation's first land-grant institutions. The proposed cuts threaten UVM's promise to contribute to the cultural well-being of the state through projects, initiatives led by the classics department, such as Latin Day, the Vermont Classical Play, which sold out in 2018 and was praised as one of the most successful humanities outreach events on campus, the Veterans Reading Group, and prison teaching through UVM's liberal arts and prison program. I worry about the long-term ramifications of UVM's vision for the future. What message does this send about UVM's values and its commitment to the education of its students and local community?